Tyler here with GP Knives, and today we're back to take a look at some of the best budget palace songs. Let's jump right in. So today we're gonna to take a look at some of the best budget ballast songs on the market. What you saw of the flipping action in the intro is about all you're gonna get from me. But we can go over some of the features and options for a ballast song, also known as a butterfly knife. This is a traditional Filipino knife. And we'll take a look at a few different options. We've got a trainer here on the table and that is gonna have an unsharpened blade and that is gonna allow you to safely learn the practices and methods for operation without the risk of a live blade where you could cut yourself. And the risk is high with a balisong, and we'll go over some of the reasons for that. So we've got the handle here, which consists of two parts. This is considered the safe handle, and this is considered the bite handle. And the reason for that is because as you can see, as this part of the handle swings up, you're gonna come into contact with the live edge of the blade, and that is gonna give you a bite. The bite handle is also the side which has the latch, and this is gonna allow you to safely latch the handle in the open or closed position for carry or use. Here we've got a nice option for a starter ballast song, in the Baron Sons. We've got a satin finished clip point and a gray with black hammered textured finish on the handles. It's got a pretty traditional look with the solid billet of the two handles and the oval hole milling. And that is gonna give a nice balance as well as good traction if you're wanting to use this knife for utility. This is also a Baron Sons trainer and you can see it's got the unsharpened blade and then a classic black powder coat on the handle. We've got a couple of other options here from Baron Sons. We've got a bayonet or spear point style blade in a two-tone with black powder coat on the flats and a satin spine. And then a white coating on the handles. And we've got an all black version here with the powder coat and a Tonto profile. And Baron Sons makes their balisongs in the USA and they do offer quite a few options in terms of the blade and handle finishes and profiles. And another piece from Baron Sons, one of their more high end options. This is a Damascus blade and you can see it has a bolstered handle design with stag inlays so a bit more of a high style option from baron sons and all of these are going to be great for an entry level option to ballast songs next up we'll take a look at a couple of great trainer options from boker this is their standard red g10 trainer so again we've got a stainless steel blade that is unsharpened so no point or edge on this at all. It's a little bit thicker than a standard blade because it doesn't have that grind. So it does have hole milling for the correct balance. Stainless liners and red G10 handles on this one. And a couple of great features that make this knife a very popular option for a butterfly knife trainer. It does have a pocket clip for carry. And it's also got a spring latch, which means that from the closed position, you can actually squeeze the handle and the latch will come open. And this makes it a very smooth operation to go from open to closed and also keeps the latch out of the way if you are learning to do some more advanced tricks and maneuvers. And another great option from Boker is the Papillon. And this is an all steel version. So we've got a skeletonized steel handle and clip point profile blade. We've got a T-latch on the back, and just a great lightweight yet well-balanced option in an all-steel construction. Another popular trainer and profile design is the Lucha from Kershaw. And you can see it has a similar all-steel construction. 
a little bit thicker on the handle here for a little more rigidity. And this is gonna be a great trainer option if you're looking for something that is made in the USA. And also if you plan on using the live blade version of the Lucha, which we have in a couple of different blade options. So this is the standard gray blasted finish. Again, this is USA made, and we've got a blade of 14C 28 inch Sandvik steel, one of my favorite budget friendly steels. Got a great stainless performance there. And then an all stainless blasted handle construction. This is an in-house design from Kershaw and probably some of the best bang for the buck in terms of a balisong. We also have this in their black wash finish and we've got a black wash finish on the blade and handle. So if you're looking for something a little more discreet with that same great US construction and performance, then the black wash version is a great choice as well. And last but not least, we have the FGX Tanto from the Cold Steel Nightshade line. This is an all polymer construction. So no metal whatsoever in the blade or the handle here. A great, exceptionally budget-friendly option that is essentially indestructible and impervious to corrosion and the elements. So a great option if you're wanting to learn the mechanics of the Balasong with a relatively safe platform and a very affordable option. Again, this is Tyler with GP Knives and our picks for best budget Balasongs. Thanks for watching, stay safe, and stay sharp. If you like what you've seen today and you'd like to see more, like and subscribe below. Follow us on social media for updates on all new products and drop a comment below on your favorite Balasong.